My name is Chrissy Flynn, the Classic Diner in Westchester, Pennsylvania, and we are about to celebrate our sixth anniversary. So we are an upscale breakfast and lunch establishment. We are a scratch kitchen, and we pride ourselves in um, all fresh ingredients. So we are known for our bacon. It's really good, it's thick cut. Our Eggs Benedict, we probably have about 15 different options of Eggs Benedict um, for breakfast. We use Lavazza coffee, which is an Italian coffee, which people just love. And for lunch, any of our sandwiches are, you know, just really big and our quesadillas are really good. So my partner started um, almost 28 years ago in our Malvern location. And then we branched out to Westchester uh, six years ago. So they love the fact that, you know, our staff is just really great to them. We have loyal customers that have been coming in for years. Sometimes we know exactly what they want before they even walk in the building. Our portions are really large, so you're not gonna go home hungry. So we had to lay off majority of our staff. It was like heartbreaking um, for some people that have been with us for years and not knowing what we were, we were dealing with. Obviously with everybody else, you know, other businesses, we're all in the same boat. We did do is rally with our catering department and start making the family meals right off the bat and people really appreciated that. We delivered for free and it was, that was just great. We took all of our catering vehicles, dropped them off at both our Malvern location and here in Westchester. And we, you know, we're obviously only open for, you know, takeout and delivery. We delivered all throughout the borough, anybody that needed anything. We're so grateful for our community of what they gave back to us, donating to us so we can donate to the uh, frontline workers and to different shelters and community, like churches and families in need, which got us through. It, 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 our community got us through. And the support that we, that we got from our customers, you know, ordering on a daily basis, even, you know, everybody's freaking out. They have, they just were, they were there for us. I, I, I couldn't ever pay back what this community did for us. Obviously we've always sanitized, but the, the plan of action that my partner and I put together the night that we were getting shut down to make sure that our team had the, all of the proper tools to make sure that the, our places were sanitized. We had a schedule of cleaning and just making sure that we were doing everything to follow the CDC um, guidelines to um, keep ourselves safe, our customers safe, and to stay open. We're hoping to not have to lay off our employees again. We're hoping that we can get through this together because all small business, whether it's the little boutique down the street, the bakery down the street, the fine dining restaurant, we're all rallying together to try to get our government to believe that we are doing the right thing. Spreading the word on social media, checking in, but the, the community is already doing everything to support us. So if you can just continue to believe that we're gonna do what we can to keep our customers safe, um, we have prepared meals through our catering department um, and we have our location in Malvern. Just um, keep spreading the love and support local. It's just been a really rough year for everybody. I mean, at all ends. And what I've learned and gained out of this is this whole situation is I've made new friends in, that, and colleagues that I've never even would have even you know, thought. The support that we've each given each other has been tremendous. And I'm so thankful for our team and what they've done to you know, rally to get us through and let's get through this winter and keep going.